welcome to this course on start your journey from embedded to iot as a arduino uno software when we are talking about the arduino uno software so arduino uno software as i have told you that to write a program for the blinking of a led so blinking of a led where i will going to write i have told you that okay uh, this is the my microcontroller chip and i have to write a program for the blinking of a led so what i have to do i have to write a program in this microcontroller chip so how i will going to write a program how i will going to upload the program on this what i have to do i have to require a software where i will going to write my program and that program will going to be uploaded on this microcontroller chip so we have got a arduino software also that is known as the arduino ide so this symbol which you will going to see when you install the arduino ide you will going to see a symbol like this so we have got a icon of the arduino ide so this is the arduino ide again it is a open source arduino software so it is been used to write a code you do the programming it on the arduino ide and you will going to upload that code on the microcontroller chips this software can be used with the any of the arduino board so when we are talking about the arduino board so we don't have a arduino uno only we have got the arduino uno arduino mega arduino nano lot of arduino boards are available and all that boards can be programmed with the help of this arduino ide so when we are talking about this ide so ide stand for the integrated development environment okay so ide stand for the integrated development environment so this is the structure which you will going to see after you have installed the program so we have got a file okay we have got the edit option we have got a sketch option and we have got a tool option so here you will going to find the board okay the board which we are talking about so here you have to select the arduino uno board and here when you select click on this arduino you will going to find that we have got different types of board arduino uno arduino uno okay arduino nano arduino mega arduino g micro mini okay lot of uh, arduino boards are lily pad arduino usb so lot of arduino boards are available and the most popular board that is been used for developing the embedded electronics products or for making the projects are your arduino uno and here we are uh, uploading the code on the microcontroller chip which we have shown you in the slides so we have to upload that code so we have to connect that usb cable okay so we have to connect that usb cable with the arduino uno board so at that time we have to select the port also that at which port we have uh, connected the usb cable so in the whenever you are using the laptop you can see that in some of the laptop you have got three port four ports okay so every port has got a address so which port your arduino uno board is been connected with the usb you have to select that port and then only you will be able to upload your code so these are the two things which are been used okay we will going to tell you more about this uh, arduino software in the next lecture where we will be writing a program so what do you have to do you have to write your sketch sketch means so in the arduino ide whenever we are writing a program we are seeing it as a sketch okay so whatever the program you are writing we are seeing it as a sketch so you, what do you have to do you have to write your sketch you have to check it whether the program which you have written has got some error or not so what you are doing you are having a compiling button so you have to press that compile button and then you have to upload the program so this check symbol is for compiling the program whatever the program you have written and this arrow will going to tell you okay if you press this if everything is right your program whatever the program you have written it will going to be uploaded on the arduino board. don't worry we will going to discuss this more in the next lecture about this how to write a program mm -hmm.